Hello there everyone, welcome back once again as we're back in for another episode of Darkest Dungeon Second Difficulty Attempt number 9 as we are taking our party of Chandos, Neville, Valley and Debolt into a ruined mission, medium length, so I would say that we are pretty prepared for this. So, only thing we can do now is just simply head in and pray for the best. Neville, you better make us some money. Pace out the halls of your lineage once familiar, now foreign. Just realized that we don't really have anyone who can spring traps. Well, this could end up being very bad. Let's see. Actually, no, no. I, I guess rally. Eighty percent rally. Okay. Well, you know what? We'll take a map. So how far is this? Okay, about that far. Well, I'm happy about it. Alright, well, getting those antiques is always nice. We won't need to worry about having to light up torches until we probably get to the room below us. Food check already, huh? Fine. Terrors may indeed stalk these shadows, but yonder, a glint of gold. Uh, I don't think we're too worried about gold at the moment, so... As the light gains purchase, okay. spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. We do have to explore 90% of the room, so... I think let's just go ahead and start by going down. This way we can proc this room battle and just kind of, you know, get it over with. Uh, blind. Yeah, that's just... I do not like this kind of fight. No sir, Lee Bob. Alright, let's see if we can... As the Very nice. Falls. A faint hope blossoms. Oh. Well, at least now it's three against four. Oh well, rather more three against three since Naval. Naval doesn't really count, I guess. I mean, yeah, she can do stuff, but how useful is that stuff? Let's be honest. Okay, so Cutthroat's dead, so that's good. Good dodge. So I guess. Just go ahead and finish us up. But death Give the party some healing. Soothed. Sedated. Ah. Ooh, very nice quote. That one's down. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Uh, Divine Grace is a six or seven heal. Yeah, you know what? Why not? I just give a bigger heal to our plague the doctor. Formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Oh, right. another pack, huh? Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. Nothing in here. That's fine with me. Although it does make me worry, since if we don't find anything, that means there's an encounter just simply waiting to leap out on us and fall our faces off. Let's see if we can debuff that accuracy. And also just kind of, you know, keep him out of the game. If we can just, you know, not have to worry about these decods here, then you know what, that, that's just fine as well. Alright, 
Kit, he is dead. That's the 38 dodge. Well, let's go ahead and take care of that. Problem. Unforeseen, unforgiving. Hey, nice. Yes, of anything, we can actually use judgment to heal up people. Give them no quarter. What is the problem with Naval? Well struck. Well, it's a good thing that she has a pretty decent defense. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Okay. Uh, we could replace the the journal page and the anti venom. Oh, hi there. Well, on the bright side, we at least got supplies. So... Flash powder. Hopefully that will screw up his... I should hopefully screw up the... Curtier's plans. Hopefully. But we'll be making sure that he doesn't get too many actions now. Meantime, eradicated. Take out the militia. That's with minus twelve accuracy. Damn. Well, I guess it could have been worse. All right. Well, let's go ahead and confidence surges as the enemy back crumbles. Right then. Go ahead and heal up our wounds. Get some light on us. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. And let's take it out. No real reason to make this fight last for too long now. Back to the pit. Very nicely done, Nato. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Okay, we get to have a scouting, so. That's a lot of... That's a lot of digging we'll have to go to if we go to the left side. Hmm. But I kind of do want to go to that left side, though. So I think what we'll do is that we'll just simply sub out the torches here. The food check, fantastic. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. We'll probably just simply use a campfire so that way we can get, we can basically get a free light, free uh, torch, torch up. Uh, let's go to infest the Cotia. Hit these two with the flash. This one, so he's stunned. And that should deal. Nope, Koti is not dead yet. Well, actually, no, Koti is dead now. Let's see. Let's go ahead and screw the brother. Hopefully that accuracy debuff Slowly, means something. Gently. This is how a life is taken. Flash powder the acolyte. Hopefully 
the accuracy debuff means something. It does not. Ah. <sighs> Well, whatever, I suppose. Executed with impunity. Damn, Chuckles. I need to go that hard on the thing. Heal him up. Ooh, very nice crit. We love to see that. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. You know, I think now's a good time as ever to fire it up. This way we can keep Huddled the together. this furtive and vulnerable. We'll just simply do a half. Maze. Could do the sanctuary, but I guess I'll just go with the Sellers Vigils, and that will also that will also stress free him a little bit. Go ahead and cure Maple stress a little bit. All right, I think that should do us. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. All right, continuing on. Well, I mean, it's a good thing that we want these medicinal herbs. Wasn't much, but I mean, something is better than nothing, I guess. Still getting a net profit, I suppose. Rooms. We'll not complain one bit about that. Give Chandos that holy power! Honestly, we could just probably do these last three rooms and call it a day there. No real reason to go trekking off into the unknown now. But I think looking at what we've gotten so far... I think we probably could be walking away with a few more witches, but... Eh, what can we do? Sometimes you just don't get lucky with getting like... A bunch of and I search with the one character. Sometimes you just don't get lucky with finding the light, uh, the all the things. Of safety. Triple spiders. This should be easy enough. I say that, but then we're going to get like bodied somehow. What's scary about? The fact is that it's definitely still possible that we could still get bodied by the spiders, but... I think we're kind of in a good situation. Alright, Whip is dead, so don't need to worry about Mark. And... All we really need to do is just simply take out the spitter. A devastating blow. Very nice. This expedition at least promises success. Ah. Well, that's a shame. Yeah, I mean, not the worst 
quok ever to be getting. Carelessness will find no clemency in this place. And with that, we can get out of here. Not too bad, not too bad. The Definitely wish I could have gotten more, and but... The yeah. walls of our ancestry are beginning to feel familiar. Oh, great, she... Neva has a black plate now. Fantastic. Guess we're gonna need to cure her from that. The beating heart of the gambling hall. Now, bloodless and still. Okay. But, uh... Get the Black Plague out of her. Don't think we really need to... Well, actually, no. Lost is pretty stressed out. But, I mean, if anything, we can just simply go for a quick round at the bar for Lost. So, I think that will be all for today's episode. We got the first profit underway so i think if you all liked today's episode if you did make sure to like button comment down below and hit that subscribe button you guys and gals that make the channel live and i'll see you all next time bye now